Chew here and welcome back to another Animal Jam video. Today I'm going to be giving you guys pack run tips, so let's get into it. My first tip is to choose an animal that runs fast. So for instance, don't pick an animal like a sloth, because obviously they're really slow. I recommend Arctic wolves, foxes, fennec foxes, regular wolves, coyotes, and either type of horse. By the way, when I'm talking about the stuff you collect, I'm going to be using the word shells since that is what you collect right now. Thank you! My next tip is to never stop to drop your shells off. Do not do this because it will slow you down. So. Don't drop off your shells until there is less than a minute left of the run, or you cannot find any more shells and there is not a lot of time left. So yeah, just don't stop at the dropping off posts, like I, how I just skipped that one right here. Yeah. My next tip is more the merrier. Basically, just invite your pack friends to join you on your pack runs because this will increase your chance at getting more shells and getting more prizes. So, if you're alone, invite your pack friends. My next tip is to not to stop to chat. So basically, I've been in lots of pack runs before and all my friends and even I sometimes would stop and chat with each other. This is a big no-no because it slows you down so much to stop and say something. So when you're doing a pack run, don't stop and say, wow, I just got a lot of shells or whatever. And look how much that slowed me down by just saying that one thing. So yeah, just don't chat. My next tip is to be quick about it with this thing, the emoji thing. So if it says an emoji, try not to take forever to look through your emojis to find it. Just pick the one it says and do it. And if it's an action movement, it shouldn't take long. So instead of doing it like this, try doing it like this. It is a little bit faster, not much, but it's faster than stopping completely. My next tip is to run around the entire map instead of just staying around in one area. So basically you're gonna get more shells if you run around the entire map instead of just like hanging out in one area. So run around like I am. My next tip is to be ready. So if you say you're gonna do a pack run with your friends, do a pack run with your friends. You can't just bail on them. And make sure that you're not doing a pack run like right before dinner or something so that your mom doesn't come in and tell you to come to dinner and stuff. Make sure that you're at a good time where you're definitely going to be ready. The next tip you should use is to just be a good teammate. So when you're running with your friends, make sure to be a good sport and to be kind to them. Help them out, be nice. And if they get more shells than you, don't make a big deal about it and get upset. Just congratulate them. And if you get more shells than them, don't be bragging to them because that'll just make them feel bad. Make sure to congratulate them as well on that. So basically just be kind and they will want to keep running with you. My final tip for you, my friends, is to use the alpha hideout. So if your buddies are not online, but you want to do a pack run, then you can go to this wonderful place called the alpha hideout where there are tons of people. Like, just look at this wonderful place. There's so many people here and we can all do runs together no matter what pack we're in, which I think is a really, really good idea. Like, I already got accepted into a pack with six people. So that is really cool and you definitely should do that if your buddies aren't on. Thank you friends so much for watching. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and have a possum day. Bye!